got nothing. I had a crazy day today, man. Uh, uh, I went to hail a taxi, and I caught a pigeon. It was like... I didn't even know I had it till I was in the cab. Oh, oh no! I'm turning into a magician. I hate magicians. Ooh. Wow, this is awesome. Because of, ooh. So, uh, I did just recently have my first menage a trois. <laughs> Thank you, yeah. Well, uh, uh, two of them were spotters. <laughs> and then when I finished, a pigeon came up. <laughs> the two spotters were like, yay! <laughs> Do another trick. Hold on, I'm so sorry, you guys. Oh, man. This is really embarrassing. Sorry. Gabriel, don't call me anymore. kicked off. <laughs> That's inappropriate. <laughs> no, it's crazy about having a disability. I always have to deal with like uh, condescending people. Like people come up to me like this. Hi. <laughs> Buddy. <laughs> How are you? I'm like, hi. People ask me if I get nervous before coming up on stage. I said, heck no, I got this many people staring at me all day. I was walking downtown and the drunk tank stopped and picked me up. I was like, uh oh. I was like, wait a minute here, fellas, there's a misunderstanding. I'm, I'm not drunk, I have cerebral palsy. They were like, that's a pretty big word for a drunk ass. I was in there for seven days. They were like, damn, buddy, what did you drink? Thank you. Only got three minutes, shut up. Um. This is also the part of my performance I'd like to inform you. You all are going to hell for laughing at me. <laughs> so a lot of you know this about me, but I am a member of the U.S. Paralympic soccer team. Uh, for those of you who clapped, I guess you realize I represent your country. <laughs> and for those of you that did not clap, well... I guess you realize I represent your country. <laughs> so does anyone know how the U.S. men's Paralympic soccer team did in the last Olympics? Oh, thank you for your support. <laughs> well, let's just say me and my teammates, well, we didn't have to worry about getting tested for any performance-enhancing drugs. We got our asses kicked! <laughs> it was all good, though. We were competing against countries like uh, Ukraine, Russia, Brazil, like countries that live together all year round and uh, practice twice a day. Whereas the U.S. team, uh, not so much. <laughs> and the thing I realized, when you're competing against countries of that caliber, 
It doesn't matter how many times I watch that movie Miracle. <laughs> it's just not going to happen. <laughs> There's some great things about being over in Athens, though. Uh, one of the things I'll never forget is there was a party for all the countries involved, like uh, Ireland, Scotland, uh, Maryland. <laughs> a little geography humor. Um, anyway, it was like halfway through the evening at this party before I realized that more than 50% of conversations... We're not being understood. <laughs> because someone who's drunk and has cerebral palsy and speaks with a Scottish accent <laughs> is really freaking hard to understand. <laughs> I remember I was chilling there, I was hanging out at the party, and this guy runs up to me and goes, Josh, man. So I cried and said, honey, I could check that can of barber's floor. I was like, yeah. 